I know it's been a while since I did like a straight vlog, but today I'm gonna try to do that. It shouldn't be too complicated. A quick update, I am down 12 pounds now. I have still been working out five days a week. It's been two weeks already, well, two weeks as of yesterday, but today makes two weeks in a day. And I feel much better. My skin is clearing up. Um, I just see very, sm I see small changes, but they're big for me because the things that were very, very unhealthy about me started to become a norm with my body. And it wasn't okay, of course, but you know. If, if something has been for so long, it starts to feel natural. It starts to feel like it's supposed to be there and supposed to happen. But a lot of stuff that I go through with my body is not supposed to happen. So I feel much better getting those things in line and working out. Like it, It's no longer a chore, basically. At this point, it's two weeks. I think this is the longest that I've worked out because... I've done two weeks, but today makes two weeks in a day. So, I've beat my best record, and I plan. I don't. I mean, I don't plan to stop anytime soon. You know, um, twelve pounds is the beginning. It has been a lot. It has been a journey, of course, and it has taken some behavioral changes, changing my behavior and the way that I'm thinking about eating, the way that I'm thinking about working out, it's nothing, you know, it's easier to get it done and be satisfied and, you know, feel great. But when you procrastinate, when you make excuses and when you just plain just don't do it at all, it really, when at the end of the day, it doesn't help you. You know, it just pushes you further back from where you need to be, you know, and a lot of people don't see where they need to be until they have a reflection on their life. When they look back on their life and they're just like, well, I haven't been living me. I don't feel like I've been living like I've been just existing um, simply because I did miss out a lot of my childhood f from being overweight Um just was very lazy very I was a very lazy child and um it tried to carry over to um a very lazy adult you know and I'm trying to change that you know it's just like it's been 20 years I'm 20 years old and you know something has to give by now like I <laughs> I have wasted pretty much 20 years of my life and not living. So I just want to update y'all on that um this morning. It it definitely feels good to step on the scale and it be it be it decreases every time. I don't want to see an increase cuz that puts me back where I used to be and I'm not a changed person. You know like this is not like my weight loss story yet you know I'm just at the beginning but it feels very nice to have stuck to something and I don't use any supplements or anything so no fat burners no um what do you call it camp uh Garcinia Cambogia um like like different detoxes I don't do any of that you know all of this comes from pure just starting a workout regimen and eating healthier I kid you not so of course I expected the weight loss to be a little bit slower than if I were on like supplements um but I'm really not trying to go there because the the uh, supplements they really crash your body like 
I used to be on fat burners and all that, and they worked like crazy. You could lose like two to three pounds in like less like in a day. So the next day you wake up, you're two to three pounds lighter. But it made me really fatigue. And if you mess up, if you don't take them, if you don't take the pills, or you know, or if you eat something you're not supposed to have, you will gain that two to three pounds back. It seems like instantly. So, if you were 100 pounds, the next day you'll be 102 pounds. If you just eat something you're not supposed to have or you forget to take your supplements. So, I didn't have time for that. You know, like the up, the seesaw of the weight loss when you're on supplements. Now, when you do it naturally, you know, you won't gain your weight as fast like you won't gain it back as fast and that's just from my experience so now like saturday i told y'all when i when i left the gym saturday i told y'all i was gonna mess up i had the halloween party and everything but i didn't do as bad as i thought i did but i had i had a cupcake i had a little portion of nachos i had sliders um i had like a soda or two and I did not gain any weight. That's the natural beauty of it. Like, I was so geeked when I when I stepped on the scale and I hadn't like, you know, I hadn't gained any weight. But I'm not sure. I don't think I lost any weight either. But I was fine with that. I did not. Well, like my whole biggest thing is that I didn't want to gain weight. You know, because I've been working so hard, and you know. The support is real. Like, I love the support. Um, my mom tells me, like, you know, your face looks a little slimmer and all that. I love that. Like, I can tell the difference in my stomach. Like, my stomach muscles are becoming more loose. I work in my stomach area. And my muscles are relaxing. Um, they're not as tight. My skin is not as tight. Um, and it's just, it's been a blessing to, like, have support. Um especially for my fellow YouTubers, I've already, you know, shouted them out, you know, but they continue to encourage me and others uh, continue to encourage me as well. But the support is very nice. Of course, people have done it by themselves, but to be really successful by yourself, it takes some dedication. And I don't think I would have been this far because I haven't passed the two weeks and and forever. I've never done it. I've never surpassed the two weeks of any diet, any workout regimen, any anything. And I can't say it's only because of me. It's not. I've had help, you know, with you know the support. I've had support. Let me say, I've had support. Um from a lot of people like I told my grandma you know um I'm getting it together and stuff like that she's like oh really congratulations and, and you know good that's good for you you know I mean no one wants to see me bad you know health or whatever or or no one wants to see me unhealthy but it became a norm since I've always been overweight and I've always been unhealthy so it's like you know no one really trips about it but I never stop. Like, even before I wasn't committed to a diet, it seems like every week I was, like, trying to start a diet or trying to do this or trying to do that. And my friend was just like, uh, another diet, uh, another diet. Like, uh, how long is this going to last? You know, like a couple of days, a couple of hours. How long is this going to last? And so, you know, I finally think this time I'm really, like, dedicated to stick with it and it's not simply because of me it's because i have support and support is is better than just yourself because at any time you can doubt yourself and you can give up but when you have people encouraging you to keep going and to keep doing the things that you're doing it's like you want to impress them, you want to impress yourself, but you want to prove to yourself that you can do it. And to all the haters and the doubters of your doing, you want to prove them wrong too. But it's just like, 
the support is very real and i appreciate that so much y'all don't understand like i appreciate it so much and i don't plan to stop finally got in my car after an hour i was sitting in my car for an hour and now i'm on my way to class i totally missed my first class and that's why i was waiting in my car for an hour because I woke up at 8 and my class starts at 8 and of course I had to get ready so I was an hour late to school I still had time to make it to class but I, I decided to park in the parking garage and by the time I thought about getting out it was like 9 10 class really really ends at 9 15 so I weighed my options and didn't go to class <sighs> my gosh why is it so hard for me to make it to class. This first class is the hardest class. I cannot, like, keep missing this class. Like, what, what really goes through my head? Like, what is going on? So now, I'm on my way to my last class of Tuesdays and Thursdays. But, I, co I totally missed my first class. I totally just, Missed it. Let's get this over with. Oh, I forgot to tell y'all. My mom and I are going to go see a movie tonight that is basically an early screening. So the movie doesn't come out till Thanksgiving. But I signed up through the movie theater that we like to go to. Uh, we like to go to and we got free movie tickets to go see a movie um yeah before it's out so that i thought that was really cool um there's so many perks that people don't read like the fine print and the boxes that's at the bottom when you sign up for anything because usually it'll ask you do you want to receive promotions and all of that, you know, most people say no because they don't want that filled in their emails. But I, you know, I took a chance and I signed up for it and got two free tickets, y'all. What? Two free tickets? Any day. Hands down, I love movies. I decided to go get some stuff since I don't have my lunch kit today. And I didn't have anything, like no snacks or anything to eat. So I got some cashews and sun chips and water, of course, and a Nutri-Grain from the bookstore. So those are my snacks for the day or well, for class too. So straight to the gym. I'm climbing a mountain. <laughs> First one here in class. Nobody else is here. Finally out of class after damn like three hours. <sighs> this is exactly why I said I hate Tuesdays and Thursdays. Oh my gosh, somebody's eating barbecue and it smells so good. I made it past that class, y'all. <sighs> Three hours. That is torture. Like, but it's not the worst. Like, it's not the worst it could be. Like, say for instance, having a, having a three-hour math class, having a three-hour English class. My three-hour class is French, so... You know what I'm saying? It's not as bad as it could be. But it's torture. Oh my God. Y'all, so since I was late this morning, I did not eat a thing. Like, well, I'm lying. I did go to the bookstore. But I didn't eat like food food, you know, like I had like some nuts. I had some nuts. <laughs> I had cashews and I had sun chips. I bought me a large water 
and a Nutrigrain. And that's what I had during class because it's three hours, you know. And now I need to eat something, some actual food, some actual, got hot, got a little hot in this beer. But uh, yeah, I need to eat some actual food. So I'm thinking more like Subway. If we have some Alfredo left from last night, I'm going to eat that first. I'd rather home cook than fast food now. Everyone knows I love fast food, but since I've done this whole lifestyle cleanse, I've tried to not eat out as much, you know, but even if I do, it's something healthy. It's a healthier choice than I would usually make. So let me go get me something to eat. Also, I've been thinking and... Um, I think that I want to call my supporters a gang, a squad, something along those lines. So, you know, I'm going to refer to y'all as a gang, a squad, a crew, something like that, you know, because my YouTube is a Trine A, like A, 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 A. So y'all yeah, are the A's, but I don't know what I'll add after that. But just stay tuned and you'll see what I pick. So, so looks like I'm going to eat Chick-fil-A. My mom decided not to save me any food last night. I don't know what that's about. But so I have no pasta at home and I'm on my way to Chick-fil-A. So I'm gonna go ahead and give me a quick workout in um, before I go and see that movie with my mom tonight. The movie starts at 7:30, but they said to be early, so right now. It's about 5 p.m., so I predict to be back to the house and freshen up and leave by 6.30, at least an hour early, um, because it is first come, first serve basis, so I want to make sure that I get there on time and have enough time to sit and, um, and enjoy the movie actually get to see the movie or whatever like that so I was just keeping y'all updated about what I was gonna do just because I have plans doesn't mean I won't work out today and let's get it day 11 wait is it yeah day 11 baby 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 yeah 